am so excited to show you what we've been working on for the last four years. Marvel Snap is the culmination of everything we've learned about making super fun card games combined with the power of the Marvel Universe. It's been an unbelievable honor to work with Marvel and Newverse on our first project. There's never been a game like Marvel Snap, and we're so excited to share it with you. Marvel Snap is a collectible card game where we stripped out all the stuff that gets in the way of fun and gets everybody straight into the strategic action. The first thing that makes Marvel Snap different than other CCGs is how fast the games are. This game is about three minutes. Both players play simultaneously. There's no waiting. We've taken your opponent's turns and your turns and layered them on top of each other so that you don't have any waiting. It's just your turn, your turn, your turn, your turn. You get to make all the decisions in half the time. With Marvel Snap, we really wanted to bring it to the next level. Another example is deck building. Once upon a time, card games had 60 card decks. You could play four copies of any card, which was actually just 15 unique cards. And so in Marvel Snap, we thought, hey, what if we just did 15 unique cards? And actually, the games are so fast. We can go down to 12 cards, which is still about the same amount of strategic depth, but it's so much easier to build a deck. The game is all about the Cosmic Cube. Oh, snap! In the rank mode, you're basically fighting against other players, trying to get more Cosmic Cubes. If you think you're going to win, you can snap your opponent, and that doubles the stakes. The whole mind games aspect does spike my heart rate a little bit. When you feel like you are going to win the game, you can double down and get more rewards back, which feels great when you win. If you retreat the game, that means you lose the game. But it doesn't feel bad. It's kind of like a skill for the damage control. It's played over three locations, and your goal is to win two out of the three locations. So the mind games start to happen as you start shuffling your cards around and trying to figure out how to outwit your opponent to secure two out of the three locations. The cards focus on the heroes and villains of the Marvel Universe. And every card in Marvel Snap has a unique ability. These powers really affect the game, and so choosing the cards that work best together is one of the most fun parts of the game. My favorite card is probably Magic. Heimdall. Viper. Galactus. Gamora. King the Conqueror. The Marvel Universe and, and Marvel Multiverse ultimately is so rich. How can we get all of that into this game? And the only way to do that is through these variants. Maybe you really like one style of variant, and so you want to collect a bunch of them and build your whole deck using these variants. We'll find like really unique artists who have such a distinctive style that we actually want to turn into a variant set. So that's another way we approach variants. It's another way to express yourself in Marvel Snap. So when we launch, there'll be well over 150 base cards for players to collect. And then we're going to continue to be adding new cards to the game every single month as these new seasons roll out. We just really want you to see that there's going to be something new in there every day. It's really important to us that you're not paying for power. The game is free to play and you can get every card in the game over time without paying anything. Got him! We can just hit one button and you're right into a game. We try to find a fair match for you. There's no pressure on you to figure out what kind of battle you want to have today. The skill cap is really high. I think you can play the snap for thousands of hours and not feel like you've perfected it. When no game feels the same, you feel like you're always learning. I think that's what's really important for a game feeling like it has meaningful depth. We have huge ambition of constantly delivering new content and constantly evolving the meta for the game. Frame break. That will deliver better experience to our players. Marvel Snap is a mobile first title, but that's not the same as being mobile only. We are working towards having an early access version available on PC at the time that we launch globally. One of the things I'm most excited about in the game are these incredible 3D effects that we have on cards. They really make it feel unlike any other card game. We did a lot of VFX around communicating an ability for a card, but we also started adding flavor effects that just make cards feel more like who they are, those characters. The music especially brings together some of the iconic feel and genre that you've come to expect with Marvel. Anytime a Marvel character has an iconic line, we made sure to record that character saying that line. Human Torch says, flame on, and the thing says, it's clobbering time. Hulk smash!
Marvel Snap is like a continuation of the fandom that many of us have had for Marvel since when we were toddlers. Now we get to pour all that passion into something that's really gonna make it out there. On Marvel Snap, I get the luxury of doing what I love. And what I love is art. You just geek out over the comics that you used to read as a kid and spend every day looking at something that is going to blow your mind. It's just a dream come true. We hope you enjoyed that first look into the passion and excitement we put into making Marvel Snap. It's been an incredible journey. Thanks to our partners at Marvel and Newverse for helping us get all this together. And oh, follow us on our social media, TikTok, Facebook, Twitter, everything. And go to marvelsnap.com. Sign up for the beta. It starts soon. We'd love to play some games with you. Thanks for watching, everybody. Neil the Fool Galactus.